god! This laser can cut grass better than an actual knife. So today, I'm gonna fix my lawnmower by replacing its 200-year-old gas engine and blade with electric motors and lasers. Ah! Balloon me! Yeah! We're gonna- Oh! That didn't do anything! When the laser spins, it doesn't actually point at anything long enough to cut it. Last year, I made this laser grid fly swatter that uses mirrors to bounce a laser beam into a grid pattern. And that didn't have any problems burning stuff in the center. But it won't cut grass because the grass gets in front of the mirrors and the beam can't bounce around anymore. So what if instead of using mirrors to bounce a single beam around, each of the beams just came from its own laser? Because I just, I already bought thousands of dollars of lasers. So I bolted the entire laser array to the bottom of the lawnmower. This is what it looks like when a small square plot of grass is directly underneath the lawnmower on straight, perfectly level rails. Look at that. Look at how perfectly straight that is. So I called my friend Kevin, who's well known for his all natural back door. I mean, backyard. And I told him I would cut his grass in the coolest way ever for a hundred bucks. I don't actually know. I can't tell if he's cutting the grass, but it looks and sounds completely insane. It actually was not cutting the grass. The first problem is that the ground in the real world is not very flat. And if the lasers aren't moving on perfectly horizontal ground, they're not going to cut perfectly horizontally. The second problem is the lawnmower itself pushes grass around when it moves, and the grass has to be perfectly still for this thing to work. And the third problem is when you have the first two problems, a lot of the energy just goes into drying the grass out instead of cutting it. So I moved over to the driest looking part of his lawn because it turns out the laser's really good at cutting brown grass. Finally, it feels like I'm really mowing the lawn and I was riding high on, on victory and grass fumes. But then something really bad and kind of obvious happened. There's a lot of smoke. Oh! Ellen, you cut the lawn on fire! I guess the future just isn't quite here yet.